More than a million and a half Missourians have already signed up to get a real ID. Millions more have not. Five on your side's Holden Kerwicki is in studio now. Holden, you found out some people are actually being denied. That's exactly right, Brent. At five o'clock, one in four people told us they had actually had issues getting a real ID, and the clock is ticking. You have until May 3rd of 2023 to get that real ID, which was originally intended to improve security. However, a local woman says it's impossible to meet the requirements unless she shells out hundreds of dollars due to rage. With the deadline drawing closer every day, 74 year old Joyce Fletcher wants to get a real ID for one reason. I didn't want to be excluded from um, government buildings and from flying anywhere. She took her birth certificate, marriage license, driver's license, social security card, and even her taxes to the Wentzville driver's license office, but was quickly denied. They, did, they didn't accept my um, marriage license because it doesn't have a stamp on it. Neither one of these that we got when we were married has a stamp on them, and uh, that kept me from getting my real license. The problem is, when she got married in 1969, the city of St. Louis didn't use the required stamp. So you can get a stamp on a birth certificate, but I haven't found anywhere yet that I could get a stamp on a on a marriage license. In search of answers, she reached out to the Missouri Department of Revenue. They said I could go around the problem by getting a passport. That cost me an extra $100, which seemed absolutely ridiculous because how is it easier to get something that you internationally use versus a Missouri driver's license. That's a question I took directly to a Missouri Department of Revenue spokesperson who told me she would look into the issue. Getting a driver's license isn't a problem for most people. More than 24 hours later, she is yet to provide a solution. For us older women who changed their names before there was a seal on a marriage license, it is a problem. That's why Fletcher has this simple request for the show me state. It's a little glitch here in your system and you need to correct it, you know, to make it hassle free for us older women. Again, the deadline to get a real ID is May 3rd of 2023. For more information on what documents you will need, head over to KSKA.com and click on the link to this story under the As Seen on TV tab.